Four turns to improve your game. Make sure you stick around to the last one to see my personal favorite and the havoc that this turn caused in La Liga this past weekend. What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. My name is Christian Silva from Silva Academy. If this is your first time on the channel and you want to improve as a player or as a coach with training drills, tutorials, and other exercises, make sure you subscribe now so you don't miss a future video. This video is from a training session I did with two youth players here in Florida going over turning and facing forward and I've also incorporated a little bit of a passing pattern as well. Four essential turns, primarily four midfielders, but any and everybody needs to learn how to turn. I've also included clips of some top pros doing the moves so you can connect the dots and see how to do them. Without further ado, let's get started. For number one, we're working on the half turn. This should be the bread and butter of really any player, but primarily for midfielders. Very important they step into the pocket with an open body shape so they can see where they're trying to go when they're playing forward. And as always, we're enforcing the habit of scanning before you receive the ball and then clean execution after you've received it. Number two, we have the outside turn demonstrated by Tiago Alcantara. Very important to note that there are very few universals in football. Uh, football is not black and white by any means, and this situation couldn't be more of an example of that. I always encourage myself as a player, and I always encourage the players I work with as a coach and as a trainer to always try and have good habits and receive the ball with an open body shape. But in this situation, it pays off to deceive the defender and trigger a pressing cue by stepping into the pocket with your hips closed. You're then able to flick it around them because they've seen that your hips are closed. They assume you're gonna either pass the ball backwards or receive it without facing forward. And they're trying to press, they're a little bit over eager. You punish them with a little flick around the corner with the outside of your foot and you get away. <laughs> Just like number two, number three is the same thing except inside of the foot turn as demonstrated by Arthur Mello from Barcelona. Again, same principles apply. You step in with a closed body shape, having already scanned and recognized a bit of space or an over eager defender. They think you're gonna go backwards because your hips are closed and you punish them by taking your touch into space. Very effective bit of turns, especially when done correctly. Thank you. 
four, the no touch turn, an absolute favorite of mine. I'll let you guys watch Frankie de Jong dish. With this move, it's very important to note that you've already scanned beforehand and recognize a pocket of space or an over eager defender. You lunge forward toward the ball, make them think you're gonna go to it, and let it roll. Use the momentum of the ball now to get away from the defender. So that's it for the video. Add these four turns to your game to make yourself more dangerous and more unpredictable on the field. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like and don't forget to subscribe. See you guys on another one.